What's up guys, this is Steve for Android at Night and today I've got something which is going to be great for all you guys who own both an Android phone and a MacBook computer. This is an app called Droid ID and this is going to let you log into your MacBook using your phone's fingerprint scanner. It is super simple to set up, all you need to do is go to the links in the description. First of all, download the app to your phone and install it. Then you want to go to the other link on your MacBook, you want to download that app and install it as well. When that's installed, you want to open the app on your phone and you'll get a unique code. You then want to open Droid ID on your MacBook. You can then input your individual code along with your administrator password. And the app will then live discreetly in your status bar. Now whenever your MacBook is locked, you can simply open the app on your phone, touch your fingerprint scanner and your MacBook will unlock. I'm just going to show you this again where you can see my finger touching the scanner so you can see just how quick this actually is. There is almost no delay. If you want to be able to use this as soon as your MacBook powers on, you want to go to your system preferences, go to where it says users and groups, select your user account, then go across to the right where it says login items, scroll down to the bottom and you should be able to see Droid ID and then all you need to do is check that. Obviously the downside with this app is that if your phone is off, it requires a couple of steps to actually launch it. You need to turn your phone on and find the app, launch it and then touch your fingerprint scanner. To make the whole thing quicker, I've got it set so that Droid ID will launch on a double tap of a blank home screen and action launcher. This means my phone is on on my desk, which it normally is. I can literally just double tap it, tap the back and I'm unlocked. Obviously there is a disadvantage with the Nexus 6P having the fingerprint scanner on the back for this. If this is just on your desk, you'd be able to open the app and tap without having to pick your phone up. Obviously you are getting a little bit of a trade-off. However, if you have a very intricate password on your MacBook, then this timing is pretty much inconsequential. It's always going to be quicker to open the app and tap it rather than typing in a 25 character password. In terms of security, the app doesn't save your fingerprint anywhere else. It's just checking against the device. The same with your MacBook password. This this is saved in your Mac's keychains and it's fully encrypted so you don't need to worry about this compromising the security of your laptop. I hope you enjoyed that guys, let me know in the comments below what you think and let me know if you've got any other awesome apps that I should be looking at. Please like this video if you've enjoyed it, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.